Hello everyone and welcome to the next part of my Pokemon 3D series Let's Play. Episode number 12-ish, I think? 13 maybe? I don't know. Anyway, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be trying to catch this red Gyarados who is out here in the lake, apparently rampaging. And yeah, I'm gonna try to catch it, you heard that. I'm not, I'm not gonna try to kill it explicitly, but if I do happen to kill it, I guess I won't really like it. Well, I won't really get sad or anything like that because, well, this Pokemon is not really that good anyway, so yeah. Uh, I'm going to put my innovation up front for once. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm actually not even going to try to weaken it whatsoever. I'm just going to poison it and it will gradually start dying. And I guess it. I guess I might succeed at catching it. I don't really know. <laughs> Let's take a look. Well, Gyarados is, is flying. <laughs> they must have taken his partial flying type, quite literally, the people who made this. What the hell, man? He's like, what the hell? He's like flying three foot in the... <laughs> Okay, well, I'm not gonna ask any questions. <laughs> Time to poison this motherfucker. Oh boy, oh boy. I am really starting to like what my team is starting to look like, to be honest. Anyway, Gyarados is now poisoned, and there you have it. <laughs> Maybe I should go for, like, an Iron Tail or something, because that's probably not gonna do too much damage. Unless if I miss, and it's not gonna do any damage whatsoever. Nah, it misses, because that's how the game works. Well, fuck my life. Yeah, are, are you guys, like, um, disappointed? Uh, because I have like chosen to use a certain Pokemon and you guys don't agree with that choice. Any opinion on that? I I'd like to know. <laughs> anyway, one, two, and he breaks free. Oh hell yeah. Well, at least he will like gradually start dying, so as the, as the match progresses, uh, my chances of actually catching him will increase, so... Although it doesn't really fucking matter now, does it? <laughs> because it's not even, it's not really paying off that much. You know what, I won't even like waste Great Balls on him yet, I'll, I'll just start using regular Pokeballs. Who knows, I mean, I might catch it with a regular one, and then I would be all masculine and all epic and awesome. Although maybe I'm just like an 18 year old playing Pokemon, which is not that epic or awesome whatsoever, to be honest. <laughs> anyway, well I'm not really planning on using this Pokemon, despite what you guys may have commented. Yes, I am making this episode without having read your comments yet, because I haven't uploaded the last episode yet. For which I'm really sorry, but I really had to make this beforehand, and it seems like I will not be able to catch this Pokemon if things keep going this way. But then he would, then he will have killed himself. It won't, it, yeah, it won't have been me. I mean, it's it's just him choosing not to choosing not to get in my Pokeball. Okay, well now his HP is red, so now my now my chance to catch him is, is like the highest. I know he breaks free, goes for a leer, hurts himself in his confusion. Or no, like due to the poison, and he will still not be mine. Probably. Let's take a look. He's got like one HP left, so. It's his fault. I know, I got him. Well, <laughs> that wasn't exactly too too bad, I guess. There you go, your data has been added to the Pokedex. Let's take a look. <laughs> I'm gonna have to rename this one. I'm gonna call him... Um... Flying... Fish. I, I wish I could type like a question mark. Lol, what? Chances are, uh, chances are, like, uh, his name will, like, turn into the regular Gyarados again, but I don't really give a fuck. Flying fish, lol, what? Oh, what is this now? This lake is full of Gyarados, but nothing else. So the magic are being forced to evolve. Did you come here because of the rumors? You're Arno, I'm Lance, a trainer like you. Yeah, a trainer, yeah, definitely you're a trainer. You're like, you're like a, 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 a demigod or some shit like that. I heard some rumors, so I came to investigate. I saw the way you battled earlier, Arno. I could tell that you're a trainer with considerable skill. If you don't mind, could you help me investigate? Sure, whatever. Excellent! It seems, it seems that the lake's magic carp are being forced to evolve. A mysterious radio broadcast coming from Mahogany is the cause. I'll be waiting for you, Arno. And he flies off into the distance. Do I have my, my freaking red scale now, or my red Gyarados scale, whatever? Let's take a look. Yeah, I do have the red scale. Okay, well, well, that's like a, that's like a key item, so I really needed that. <coughs> oh boy, I don't have any repelled anymore. Well, that kind of sucks. So I'm gonna have to like try to avoid the grass, I guess. Oh no, I don't like this. I know what this is. I'm not entering that place, or otherwise I will get like 1,000 Pokey bucks stolen from me. And we don't really want that to happen, now, do we? There you go. Jump over those two ledges because I am completely awesome. I should be like a free runner or some shit like that. Anyway, time to go onwards. Uh, also, I have now noticed that I am nearing the 1,000 subscriber mark. Which is completely epic, guys! Like, I, I will try to um, do another live stream or some shit like that. I don't know whether I'll succeed or not, but who knows? 
Then, but again, for yeah, for it, yeah, for it to be a live stream, it's gonna have to be a Game Boy Advance game though, like a ROM hack or some shit like that, because uh, my computer will probably not be able to live stream a Nintendo DS ROM or some shit like that. Or maybe I could just like stream something, yeah, stream something completely different, like for example, Happy Wheels or some shit like that. Like I've never really played that game before. Anyway, there's actually one thing that we still have to do. One big thing, I think. Uh, let's go to the PC and let's pull out our Eradicate. Yep, Radigate because he knows, like, cut or some shit like that. Oh no, we can't put this Pokemon there because I still need that Surf. Yeah, you, you guys probably know what I'm gonna do now. Like, I had sort of, like, forgotten about it. There you go, log off. Am I actually, like, already able to, uh, take on the gym yet? No, I'm not. Oh, fuck my life. Doesn't really matter. Okay, so I, I need to go back here and I, and I need to, like, cross that water again. And that's exactly what I'm gonna be doing now. I am doing so many dangerous things now, aren't I? <laughs> oh boy, I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. I have that a lot, by the way. There you go, got away safely. Now, as you can see, there was this sweet goon standing here, and I'm like, I want to, I want to have a sweet goon. Yep, I do. So uh, let's take a look. Oh, what the fuck, man? He just walked on top of that tree. What? Well, that makes sense. Okay, well, Suicune escaped me again. Rats! <laughs> I guess that's like the, that's like a good way of putting it. Ah, uh, it doesn't really matter. There you go. Let's, well, let's cross the water again. I mean, I will catch that fucker one day. I don't know how, I don't know when, but I will. And I, I, I probably won't even, like, end up using him, like, anyway, so it doesn't really matter that much. Come on, man, what the fuck? I, I'm gonna stubbornly keep on trying to run away until I actually run away. Like, what the fuck is that shit? I mean, I, I'm a freaking grass horse thing, or llama, whatever. <laughs> I mean, I do look like a llama, and I can't even run away from a freaking fish. It's a fish! It doesn't even have arms or anything like that. Like, why am I in it? What the hell, man? This just doesn't make sense whatsoever. Shit is getting real, I guess. Okay, so now, I guess, a somewhat boring part of the Let's Play is going to start, which is me beating the crap out of Team Rocket. I'm sorry that I'm sorry that I find this boring, but it is freaking boring. I, I'm sorry, but I've already played through this part of the game like a bazillion times. Oh, look, 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 look at yeah, look at this guy's stats. A special, the special attack is completely awful, and that's why it's not a good water Pokemon. Sorry, but Surf would not be good on this Pokemon, despite it being one of the best water moves there is. The only thing that's mentionable is that was that freaking physical attack. That's pretty decent, <laughs> but then again, it's not really. I don't know. Like, what? He only knows Leer. He had been using Twister and shit on me, so that's like a glitched as well. So there's literally no reason whatsoever to use this freaking Magikarp. I'm sorry, but that is the truth! Time for the truth siren. Oh god, I'm weird. <clears throat> anyway, Dragonite, Hyper Beam! Dragonite, return! What took you, Ordo? Just as I thought, that radio, strange radio signal is coming from here! Okay. The stairs are right here! Well, how do you see that? Like, I... I are you, can you smell that or something? Are you like... I don't know. Anyway, I'm, I'm gonna save the game now be, simply because I don't want to risk having the game crash on me or something like that. Like, I'm at quite an important part of the game, so yeah. Okay, now I'm gonna have to battle these people. Yep, you heard that. Um, time to put my Tsurugi up front, I guess? I'll, ju I'll just like try to get him to be level 30 or some shit like that. That could possibly work out quite well. Hey, I tried to relax! Sure, whatever. So I'm the intruder. I mean, it, it, it's it's you who is like, I don't know, breaking the law and shit, but you, you don't really pay attention to that now, do you? <laughs> anyway, Fury Cutter does a lot of damage. He goes for Confusion, which doesn't do that much damage, ironically enough. <laughs> there you go, man. I'm level 28 now. Next one up, Zubat. I can't really do too much against Zubat, despite sing uh, despite one hit killing it. <laughs> oh boy, this my Tsurugi is so goddamn epic. He he like he should be I don't know, he should be put into jail or some shit like that. This this guy is so offensive, it's not even natural anymore. Anyway, another Zubat. Oh boy, am I so intimidated right now? <laughs> oh my goodness, this is pathetic, guys. Completely pathetic, you know. Like you're not even worthy of trying to battle me. The only guy who is is like some is like some epic person like Lance or some shit like that. Oh, and I miss? Oh no, I didn't miss. Okay, sorry. I, I don't really know why I thought that I had missed or something like that. Quick attack, and you're dead. There you go, Regetta. 
Okay, well, he doesn't really say too much, but I don't really give a fuck. Okay, now there's actually one thing that I really want to do. I don't want to have to battle all these Team Rocket members. I'm sorry, I mean, they do give me some XP, but they're just not worth it. So what am I going to do? I'm going to go to this room. Oh, battle this dude, I guess. This was once a ninja hideout. There are traps to confound intruders like you. Yeah, too bad I'm going to I'm going to turn it off. I know that's not exactly your plan, but I'm going to turn that shit off nonetheless. <laughs> okay, I'm actually going to try to beat this guy with my uh yeah, w with my flying pokemon, which was not exactly the best plan in the world, but I guess it was worth a try, maybe. <laughs> Who knows. Anyway, Razor Leaf, that's going to do some damage as well. Or not. I don't really give a fuck, to be honest. I'm just going to stubbornly keep on using Razor Leaf until I finish you off, Mr. Magnet. <sighs> this sucks, man. There you go, man. You're dead. Finally. He's probably going to send... Oh, he sent out another one. Are you shitting me? You deserve to get your ass whooped right now. Okay, now let's switch Pokemon. Go to my Charmeleon. Take that Thunder Wave and enjoy it. And let's use Ember, I guess. Look, this part is just so boring! Oh boy! I am literally starting to fall asleep at this part of the game. I'm sorry, but there's nothing to do! It's just long, empty, boring rooms full of Team Rocket members with the same boring, under-level Pokémon that don't give any XP and don't pose a threat whatsoever. Ugh. At least I can now finally turn off this, uh, this trap, so... Yes, better press it. Yeah, the switch is turned off. Okay, that's good. I guess now I'm gonna have to go back to the Pokemon Center now, which is gonna be a good thing. Now I'm not gonna have to battle all these freaking stupid Pokemon, uh, Team Rocket members anymore, so that's a good thing. Oh, what the fuck is happening? I'm losing control! <laughs> I can't control my character anymore. Well, for, for a second I couldn't, so yeah. Anyway, there's Joy. Please do heal up my Pokemon, thank you very much. There you go. There's actually like a way to avoid all these uh, Team Rocket members as well. And I'll show you guys that way in a second, I guess. Let's go back to this freaking store. I don't even know what I don't even know why why Lance felt like he had to go here, but apparently he doesn't like this store. So yeah, what, one thing that you can also do is go here and go past all these like traps. I'm not really gonna do that now because I've already turned off these. Uh, I've already turned off these the yeah, the secret switches. So yeah, high proportion. I guess I can use that. Let's keep on going. Well, the only thing that's sort of, like, mentionable is, like, the good music. Like, the music is pretty decent. And I find a nugget as well. Pretty decent. Now, let, I'm at, I am here again. I'll take a look. Are you alright? My well, Pokemon are hurt and tired. Here, give them some of my medicine. Wait a second! I have just gone to the Pokemon Center! Well, that was rather useless then. Well, it doesn't really matter. What is this? The door is closed. It needs a password to open. Can't I, like, climb over or some shit like that? I mean, seems very doable. But maybe I'm just European, and Europeans are weird, aren't they? <laughs> I mean, that, that's what I hear a lot from Americans. And no, Americans are not weird whatsoever. <coughs> except, for, except for on, like, Black Friday or some shit like that. We have, we have like, I don't, I don't know, like, I, like, we have some sort of holiday concerning Friday as well, but then that has, to, that has something to do with, like, Jesus dying and stuff. I don't know. I don't know whether we call it Black Friday, well, our, our Dutch equivalent, <coughs> but we don't have Black Friday, where I live. <coughs> where I live, we don't even have a freaking. Um, no, we don't even have freaking Thanksgiving. How sad is that? But we do have like an, uh, we do have like a different uh, holiday sort of thing which you guys don't have, and that's why you guys decide. Well, you guys. When I say you guys, I say Americans because it was an American who was like, eh, that holiday that those Europeans have is racist. Because, because like, yeah, like, like for example, with Christmas, you have the Christmas fairies who, like, work and, like, create all these presents for the children. There's nothing wrong with, with, with like, abusing these fairies or these elves or whatever. But there is something wrong when you, when you turn that guy into, into a guy who's black. Apparently, they find that racist. I'm sure, I'm like, sure, it could be considered, bl it could, yeah, it could be considered racist, but if you know the actual story, you, you know that they are black, not because they are, like, from, from Africa or some shit like that, but they are black because they, they have to, like, crawl through chimneys. Then it's not racist anymore, but those Americans are, like, butthurt, and they're like, hey, this is, like, against freedom, and, and, 
yeah, I'm butthurt. So yeah, you have to stop that. And, and yeah, so that, that's exactly what, what yeah, that's, that's exactly what they said to the UN. And the UN is now like uh, pissing on us, and they're like telling us that we have to stop uh, celebrating that awesome holiday, which is way more awesome than Christmas. But we're we're not gonna succumb to to, to the pressure of society. And I don't even know why I'm like explaining this to you, but. Well, now at least you, at least you know what what the average Dutch guy is concerned with. Anyway, here we have Ditto. How nice. Now Ditto is gonna pound me all over the place. Doesn't really matter that much because I can take a bit of pounding. There you go. And I want to learn Slash. That's pretty fucking decent. So let's do this. Poof. And I forgot agility, and I learned Slash. Here you go. Okay, so I need I need like two passwords or some shit like that. And, uh, I guess I'm gonna have to arrange that for some, like, somehow. Yuck, yuck, yuck! You're challenging me to a battle? Ha, huh, you're nuts! But you have guts! I like that! If you can, if you beat me, I'll tell you a password to the boss's room! Okay, so yeah, but, you know, I, I think it's like this. I need two passwords to get to the boss, and then the boss is going to give me the password to open that other door. I think that's how it works. Yeah, that's probably pretty correct. Anyway, let's go for a wing attack! Wing attack is so goddamn awesome, man. Fuck my life. Eradicate bites the dust. Yuck, yuck, yuck. The password is Eradicate Tail. Yuck, 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 yuck. Uh, is that like laughing or are you like having some sort of seizure right now? The password to the boss. Yeah, I've already. <laughs> you've already, you've already like said that to me that it's Eradicate Tail. So, fuck you. Right up your ass. There you go. Protein. Okay, so I picked up some rather good stuff. Now let's keep on going. I have to battle some more people in this room, I suppose. Yeah, I'm gonna try to like rush through this place like as soon as possible. I'm pretty sure that, that I'm pretty sure that this person like uh yeah yeah she knows the other password. Team Rocket Grunt, you're a bitch, you know. And I'm going to wing attack you, and you will die in one hit. <laughs> oh my goodness, like such a reliable Pokemon this guy is. For fuck's sake, man, Scyther, you're so goddamn epic, and he's gonna turn even even more epic when he uh, evolves. Into Sizer. Anyway, so, so the other one is Slowpoke Tail, and we all we, we've all had our experience with Slowpoke Tails, huh? I still remember those two hot Slowpokes back in the Slowpoke well. <sighs> they should probably lock me up or some shit like that. <laughs> I am turning more criminal by the day. What the hell is this? The switch is turned off. I don't know what that means, but whatever. <laughs> Time to keep on going. Am I actually like level 30 already? I, pro I, I don't think so, but anyway. Oh, okay, I don't really like this, but el I, but eliminate, <laughs> eliminate you I must. And you are speaking like Yoda, but I make you sound like some sort of, I don't know, hyperactive chipmunk who can't speak English, because that is what I am. That's why, I deci that's why I've decided to never use a webcam in my videos like PewDiePie does. It's because I look like a, like a hyperactive chipmunk. And you don't want to see that. Okay, actually, I, actually, I've got like a question for you guys. What color do you think my hair is? Chances are you have not seen my uh, my, my real face yet. Well, actually, you have because I'm like that famous and stuff that you probably n yeah, that you probably know, know everything about me, ranging from the color of my eyes to the size of my feet. Like everyone knows me. I'm I'm like Justin Bieber times a billion. Like One Direction has l One Direction learned everything from me. That that's how freaking famous I am. So yeah. Do you guys know what, what color my hair is? Um, I'm going to like tell you guys in the next episode, I suppose. Anyway, TM46. There we go. That, that, that's Thief or some shit like that, so it's not exactly too bad, but then again, I don't really need it that much. Oh, what's this? Didn't I tell you that I was going to destroy Team Rocket? Tell me, who was the guy in the cape who used Dragon Pokemon? My Pokemon were no match at all. I don't care that I lost. I can beat, I can beat him by getting stronger Pokemon. It's what he said that bothers me. He told me that I don't love and trust my Pokemon enough. I'm furious that I lost to a bleeding heart like him. <laughs> I don't have the time for the likes of you. Yeah, because your Pokemon lost and now you're butt hurt. Suck on that, bitch. You I like, like next time next time we battle, I'm going to wipe the floor with you as well. Just like I did the last time. And the time before that. Okay, now what, what the fuck is this? The door is closed. I enter the two passwords, and the door opens, surprisingly enough. Am I actually level 30 yet? No, I don't think so. What? Who are you? This is the office of our leader, Giovanni. Since disbanding Team Rocket three years ago, he has been in training. But we're certain he will be back someday to assume command again. 
That's why we're standing guard. I won't let anyone disturb this place. Oh, Executive Petrol. Nice to meet you. You are a stupid little, little fella who uses a Zubat. And I have nothing against Zubat, but still Zubat sucks. I mean, he just does. Coughing. More like... Coffin, ha 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 ha, because it's like dead and like in his coffin, and and yes, I am really bad at making puns. <laughs> it doesn't change the fact that that he will have gotten the floor wiped with his Pokemon. There you go, Radicate. So much for petrol. Like y y your freaking like grunts are, are are like better than you are, to be honest. You did okay, but Brad, but wait till next time. Now I can't let this affect me. I have to inform the others. Sure, whatever, whatever. Mirko, the password is Hail Jeffy. <laughs> yep, yep, I did that on purpose. <laughs> it's not like I can't get that that high of a voice pitch or anything like that. I mean, I have the voice of an angel, don't I? Okay, so the password is Hail Giovanni. What a nice password that is. Completely, completely impossible to find out without having like without like having to hear it. The door is closed, I enter the password, and it opens. There you go. Hold it right there! Oh, what's this? What? It's a ginger! I don't like gingers in this game, because they're always, like, aggressive. We can't have a bread like you on the loose. It's harmful to Team Rocket's pride, you see. However, strong you may be, you can't take both of us at the same time. Sorry, baby, now get ready to be thrashed. Oh, what's this? Hey, don't be so selfish, spread the fun around! What? You had an accomplish? Where's the sense? Where's your sense of honor? As wait, wait a second. You were ganging up on me with two people, and if I if I get some reinforcements, then you say that I have no sense of honor. Let me bitch slap you all over the place. Yeah, show me how strong you are. If this is the strongest that you can, if this is the strongest that you can get, you're not gonna be that much of a threat, to be honest. I mean, like Arbok, are you shitting me? <laughs> oh God damn it! I am so intimidated right now. There you go, Orbok is dead. Next one up is Murkrow. I'm gonna change Pokemon and go to my... I don't really have too many things that I can use against flying Pokemon, besides Big Daddy. But if he would go for a flying move like Peg, then that would do a little bit of damage. But then again, I'm really defensive, so I can take it. An Ice Punch will probably kill you now. Yep, it does. Oh, god damn, it's such a good Pokemon. And last but not least, we've got ourselves glue, and I'm actually gonna I'm actually gonna stick around and use Ice Punch for once, and see if and see if that does a lot of damage. And it sort of does, but I do fall asleep now, which kind of sucks. Oh, but he's gonna keep on using Sleep Powder, so it doesn't really matter that much. There you go, you're dead now. So this was the best, you, yeah, this was the best you could throw at me. Not too good now, is it, Executive Ariana? And I don't, I don't even know whether you're a girl or not. This hideout is done for, but that's fine. The broadcast experiment was a total success. It doesn't matter what happens to this hideout now. We have much bigger plans. You'll come to do, you'll come to appreciate Team Rocket's true power soon enough. Enjoy yourself while you can. <laughs> that did it. We defeated all the rockets here. But I'm concerned about the young guy I battled in the process. Sorry, Arno. I saw how well you were doing, so I just hung back. Now all there is left to do is turn off that odd radio signal. Wait a second. So you were letting the ten-year-old do all the work? Anyway, to summarize all this, he's gonna be like, Oh, we need to, like, kill all the, uh, electrodes who are, like, powering this evil machine which is turning the Gyarados into... Well, which is turning the Magikarp into Gyarados forcefully. So I'm just gonna have to, like, quickly beat the crap out of all these people. Which is not exactly gonna be too hard. Actually, I can just, like, run away. And that's actually way easier, since I'm, like, a fast Pokemon anyway, so I'm gonna have no problems running away from this. <laughs> well, this is kind of epic. LOL, I am trolling the game. Like, actually, in the real Pokemon games, you can all, you can also do this, so you don't even need to kill all these Electrodes. You can just, like, freaking run away. And nope, I'm not gonna catch Electrode. I'm sorry, he's just not a good Pokemon. What's this now? That odd signal has finally stopped! The lake should be back to normal. You're the hero! Let me thank you on behalf of the Pokemon. Oh yes, you should take this. I found it here, but I don't have any need for it. HM6, what is 6? Whirl Whirlpool, teach two Pokemon to get across wild water, but keep this in mind, you can only use that uh, from the seven, if you have the 7th gym badge. Or no, the journey to, po to becoming the Pokemon Master is long and difficult. Knowing that, will you keep going? I see, no, you're right. If you would, if you would give up that easily, you would, never, uh, you, would, you would have never chased that dream in the first place. I look forward to seeing you again. Whatever, whatever. 
Okay, so I pretty much saved the day right now. I'm sorry that I didn't really do any anything besides battling Team Rocket members. That kind of sucks, to be honest, but it doesn't really matter that much. Now, I can finally try to take on the gym, and that's going to prove to be quite interesting, I suppose. But yeah, first I'm going to uh, quickly ev uh, quickly like evolve my Pokémon into uh, Sizer. I mean, that's going to be rather cool, I guess, so let's quickly take a look, save the game, there you go. I'll be back in a second. Why, blimey! I did it! And I did it without really, like, evolving him either. Like, I just pretty much changed the number, which is, like, way easier, I guess. So now I've got Turugi! And his freaking physical attack is already awesome. That special attack is a little less, I guess. But, I, I mean, I don't really rely on him for, for his special moves or anything like that. And he is a, just a complete... Com he's, he's just, like, a complete monster. That, that's all I can say. I'm quickly gonna, like, try to battle some random thing and uh, see whether I can, like, beat him. Uh, let's take a look. You are the chosen one. Who am I going to beat? Or which Pokemon? A freezer Pokemon, so you can't do a thing, is what Bo is what Border Ronald says. Or Ronald. And he sends out Seal. Yep, Seal prepared to get Wing Attack. Well, Wing Attack actually doesn't... Hey, it won't do that much damage anymore, since I don't have Stab on it anymore. But I guess Fury Cutter can still do it. And I'm also going to have to, like, uh, get some pretty de Yeah, Fury Cutter does a lot of damage. Well, yeah, for, for, yeah for, for the first move, it does a lot of damage already. So it's only going to, like, keep on growing as the match progresses. So from now on, like, like every rival battle, every gym battle, is going to be a piece of cake with this, to be honest. And, I mean, like, uh, Wing Attack still does a lot of damage as well, so that's pretty good. Here you go, you're dead now. I can probably, like, one-shot Dugong as well now, because it's, like, been four... It's been, like, four Fury Cutters, or three Fury Cutters. Yeah, as you can see, like, like... Uh, it, all it takes is, like, three Fury Cutters, and you can one-shot anything. Like, this is just a complete badass, this Pokémon is. Anyway, so much for that. That's for the next episode. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the episode. I am getting loads of shit done right now. That's pretty awesome. And I also got to see how awesome uh, Tsurugi looks now. I'm kind of pleased with it. Thank you for watching and goodbye.